in this video let's discuss about IP helper address actually what is IP helper address and what is the use of IP helper address suppose when now DHCP server is relies on remote network or some different network and we would like to configure IP address from DHCP server but the issue is DHCP server is not in the same network in such situation we should configure IP helper address in Cisco devices okay in Microsoft we will tell this as a DHCP frame relay both are same concept okay let's discuss IP helper address using Cisco router so in this video I will demonstrate you a lamp for this okay let's get started first let's create a lab for this I use the router here we are using two router let's name router A and router B okay Let's connect each other using fast Ethernet 0 by 0. And we need one switch, sorry, two switch, one here, one here, and some systems. And user, we need to test the DHCP address. and actually I would like to configure DHCP server this one DHCP server router A is our DHCP server ok and let's connect each other These are two network, network A and network B and I would like to configure first network IP address 192.168.1.0 slash 24 from DHCP and same as network router B 2.0 slash 24 ok and this network will be 10.1.1.0 slash 24 ok let's get started let's configure the IP address for the router interfaces. So let me um, take the console of router A and type now. Enable config T, sorry, config T interface fast internet. Let's check this one 0 by 0, 1 by 0. 0 by 0 IP address is 10.1.1.1 255 255 255.0 Sorry for the command 
IP address 10.1.1.1 255.255.255.0 Now shut down for enable the interface Again interface fast ethernet 0 by 1 Sorry 1 by 0 IP address 192.168.1.1 mask 255.255.255.0 now shut down for enable the command. The interface is just enabled. Let's go to router B console and let's check which are the interface we are using. This one faster than it 0 by 0, faster than it 1 by 0. Okay. Enable to like this. Config T interface of a 0 by 0 IP address 10.1.1.2 mask 255 255.255.0 Now shut down for enable the port the port is enabled now interface 1 by 0 by 0 IP address 192.168.2.1 mask 255.255.255.0 now shut down. So enable the port. Port is enabled. Now all the interfaces, all the both routers are enabled. Now what we need, we need to configure IP address for the end devices. For PC0, PC1 in the network, first network and PC3 and PC2 for the second network. Okay. So our DHCP server relies in where it is. Our DHCP server is in network router it means in first network so let's take the console of the DHCP server and let's configure DHCP IP DHCP let's exclude some addresses okay P DHCP exclude address 192.168.1.1 actually we configured for router A FA 1 by 0 interface so we cannot you so DHCP server can't use this address it will become conflict so we excluding this address from 192.168.1.1 to 1.20 I just excluded okay. now let's configure DHCP server IP DHCP pool I give the name network A you can give any name network 192.168.1.0 mask 255.255.255.0 default router means the default gateway of the particular network this network 192.168.1.0 network default gateway will be 192.168.1.1 ok exit let's come to pc0 Let's see that we are getting the IP address from DHCP. Let's check. Requesting IP address. Successful. See. The DHCP server give the address 192.168.1.21. Because up to 20 we already excluded. So it started from 21. And for the PC1 got the IP address. Requesting IP. It gives 22. Okay. Now this is the concept of DLCP. Now we are going to discuss the concept of IP helper address. Where we should configure IP helper address. Actually see when our 192.168.2.0 network. I would like to configure DLCP for the 2.0 network from the same DLCP server. So you can see the 2.0 network is in different network and DHCP server located in different network both are different network so in this case we should configure extra IP helper address on the second network I will show you I'll demonstrate you okay let's configure DHCP pool for the router B or second network 2.0 network okay let's come to your console 
DHCP server console and I change the host name DHCP. Okay. Okay. Let's configure IP DHCP excluded address. I'm excluding the same range 2.1.2 because 2.1 we already use it for the gateway and 192168 2.20 up to 20 I'm excluding create some DHCP pool CP pool I give a network we just give a name you can give any name and use the command network network address which range address they should get 2.0 and the mask Subnet mask should be 255.255.255.0 and default router means default gateway of the 2.0 network range that should be 2.1 so we configure like that 2.1 exit that's it see if we configure DLCP in the end users Let's check DHCP. We are getting the 2.0 range from DHCP. Requesting IP address. See now DHCP failed because Appify is being used. Why? Actually, when the PC3 or PC2 or any PC in this network requesting send a request for the DHCP server, the request won't reach to DHCP server because both are in requesting device and DHCP server both are located in different network so actually first we do some routing this route I am using the static route it's a DHCP server I hope you already know the routing IP route 192.168.2.0 network mask 255.255.0 and the next hope address will be address of the fast ethernet 0 by 0 address IP address okay that is 10.1.1.2 okay same way we have to add a reverse route on the router B config T IP route 192.168.1.0 Subnet mask 255.255.0 and next to up will be 1.1 .1, 10.1.1.1. Okay, so routing is done now. Let's see DHCP getting the address static request again. Again, it's failed. Why we should configure the IP helper address on which interface we have to configure we have to configure on the default gateway interface so we need for this 2.192.168.2. network and uses gateway will be 2.1 that means which interface this one fast ethernet 1 by 0 interface now let's go to the interface interface fast ethernet 1 by 0 IP helper address then which address IP helper address means the DHCP server address that we can configure 10.1 10 sorry 10.1.1 10 there is two address why we use 10.1.1 means in the DHCP server are two address one is 10.1.1 and 191 1.1 you can use any of the any IP I use the 10.1. Dot one dot. See, it's got the IP address 192.168.2.21, and for the PC3, Now the IP helper is working. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you.